When I think about the work we do here at Housing Works, what we do is we identify individuals who are the most vulnerable living on the streets, we build a rapport with them, and we get them off the streets and into housing. So once we house them, we become their advocates. We become a part of their life. We do everything possible to negotiate with landlords, to work with them to ensure that they have steady income, to make sure that their health is connected to a medical home. So we're basically there to advocate for their lives in every aspect. He's not staying in the shelter, dude. I thought you wanted both of them in the shelter. She's staying in the shelter. Fine. Fine. The core to what we do is always embedded in the saying, whatever it takes as long as it takes. Whatever it takes for as long as it takes. So for instance, when we have someone who is acutely mentally ill, who maybe needs someone to help monitor their medication intake every day, if the, if the tenant cannot be relied upon to do this on their own, it doesn't mean that they don't deserve or cannot live independently. It means that they need an added layer of support. And we step right in and we do what we need to do to ensure that that person gets their needs met so that they don't cycle into psychosis, end up back in the hospital, and end up sometimes back on the streets.